So in order to put your Picasso slideshow directly into your blog, the first thing you need to do is to open up Picasso. And if you start typing in Picasso, it should automatically come up with Picasso Web. And then when you're in this um, uh, Picasso albums, you should see all the ones that you've um, made before now. So you click on the one that you want to add, whichever one it happens to be, and you should see all the photos that you uploaded to it. Now the first thing you'll notice is that on mine, I've got some little um, buttons here, post on blogger um, and link to this album. Now if you don't see that, you'll need to just alter the um, privacy setting. It's right up here in the top right hand corner. If you click edit and you'll notice right down the bottom here, visibility. So if you can change that please to limited anyone with a link or public if you don't mind anyone else um, stumbling on it and then click save changes. And once you've done that, it's probably confused because I've already got that, <laughs> you should see these, um, these areas here. Now the first one, if you click post on blogger, this will essentially give you a very simple, very quick upload that puts the photo album cover directly into a new post. It even calls, um, calls it the name that you've called the album and then it publishes it direct. So if I was to click this it would appear immediately on my blog. Um, I may not be blog uh, signed in first but it looks like I am. Let's go to view blog. Have a quick look and there it is. Now the thing about this one it's very simple it has uh, just a photo, so you might need to put what it is. Um, but if you click onto it, it's just taking a little while to load because I've got a very big blog here. But once it does work, you click onto this and then it will link directly to the Picasso album. Sadly, I can't show you that. Oh, here we go, it's ready. So if I click on this, and then it takes you to the Picasso album. So it's not essentially in fact it's not at all an embedded slideshow and I think that's really what most of you want to do. So in order to do that you must go to link to this album. And when you click that, <laughs> it's funny that it's slow today, sorry. When you click on that, you eventually... Oh, if only I could pause my screencast. Otherwise we have to wait for this for a little while. Let's just try one more time. There we go. Sometimes it's good to have some patience. So um, now it gives you a couple of different options. Paste link in email, paste HTML, an embedded website. But this is the one that I showed you in class, Embed Slideshow. So you click that and up pops a little box. And here's the slideshow um, showing you that it's working. So I'm going to click Show Captions. You don't have to if you don't have any captions, but I think it'd be useful to know whose picture is whose on my website. So um, at the moment, this is the you are uh, sorry. This is the HTML code. Someone's kindly um, managed to put it all together for us. So you just click it once, very simply, without deleting, backspacing, or anything, and it will copy onto the clipboard that you um, that uh, HTML code. So then do Command C to copy. Go to your blog new post call it as you wish Picasso album and then paste that code directly in there okay now the clever ones of you will notice that actually some of it makes quite a lot of sense the width the height and you can even change these if you get really fancy um, to adjust the size. But what we're going to do, we're just going to check that it works. We're going to go to preview. Keep your fingers crossed. For 99% of students it works. <laughs> For some reason this one isn't and I have no idea why that is the case. So um, if this does happen to you, just close out of that a moment. We go back. We haven't published it yet so we're not going to look silly. Um, sometimes it's a little fault or something within the coding here. But I think what I'm going to do is just try another one. 
and just see what happens. Sometimes you can actually paste in the HTML code and see if it makes a difference. Sometimes it's actually just the website itself. And I know the other day I tried this one, and I know it worked perfectly. So sometimes it can be the um, <coughs> the the website itself, and it just has a bit of a hissy fit on you. So I'm just going to try this one, knowing that it worked the other day. Exactly the same um, method again. New post. Command V, review. <laughs> so it's not working today. Okay, that is quite unusual. So I'm guessing, knowing that that definitely, definitely worked the other day, that there's something up with the, the website, the Picasa website, or, um, or even the code itself. Um, it shouldn't be, because I know for a fact that this one worked beautifully the other day. In fact, if I go to Blogger, I'm going to close this down. I'm going to view the blog. I may well have deleted... There we go. No, this is the one that worked. This is the one I showed you in class. It's taking a while to load today. But if you scroll down past this blog post about poor, and then here it is here. So I know for a fact that it does work. So let's go back and we'll try this one just to really test it out. So you go to home, and my photos. Let's see where it is gazing. Under my photos, let's check it out. Here it is, gazing by grade 7. There's the file that I put up the other day. I've got it on a different setting here. I've got United World College. So you might want to try a different um, privacy and visibility. Let's try embed, copy, logger, new post. Paste. Looks okay. Preview. And it does the same thing. So that suggests that today it's not wanting to play. But if you go back to, let's go out of this and go out of that, we know, because we've just seen it, that it worked when I showed you in class the other day. So this album, this code is definitely correct. There's something not working on Blogger today. So I think that may well be the problem that some of you are facing. So be patient, try it again. And then once you've got it to work, it will look as beautiful as this here. When it doesn't work, then it will look as ugly as what I just showed you where it just shows the, the code. But don't give up. Try a couple of times. As you've seen, for me, it hasn't worked today, but it worked perfectly well the last three or four days. OK, I hope that's been of use to you. This is Mrs. Hambledon checking out.